Hello YouTube and welcome to a pretty cool tutorial on how to make levitating popsicle sticks um, using popsicle stick origami. No, uh, I'm kidding. It's just a it's it's a pretty cool tutorial on uh, how to basically do this. Make them stick together miraculously. See, no strings or anything without using glue because if I take one of these out it falls apart. It's something pretty cool you can show your friends. I'm sure you could somehow turn it into some gambling thing if you're if you're into that stuff. All you need are half of the sticks that I'm holding here. Five. Now you can do these with popsicle sticks. Um, I'm not using those because I don't have any for one and two. These are easier to use actually. They're like these tongue depressors that I'm sure if you Ask nicely, your doctor will probably wouldn't give to you. I got these at a craft store somewhere, and I'm not sure exactly where. Um, but all you really need are five little sticks here. Um, if you're using popsicle sticks, though, word of warning, the, they will break a lot. So you might, if you're going to do it, carry six or seven of them instead of five to make one. Or, or maybe even carry ten. That way, if, if they don't break, you can make two. And if, if they do break, at least you can make one. So, I'm going to teach you how to do these. The reason they break is you're going to put a lot of tension into these things, or a lot of a... Uh, yeah, you're going to bend these things so there's a lot of, like, tension, so it's like a spring. And it holds it together because it's, it's all the, there's all this friction between the two stick things, but we're not going to go into that. So all you have to do is basically hold these three sticks together, like so, okay? Now, note is is you're gonna have these two sticks like this and you're always gonna put this stick the middle stick the middle one in the back okay so you have three sticks like this and the middle stick here is behind these two next you're gonna take one of these sticks right here and you're gonna go loop through and you're gonna weave it through now you want to weave it so it goes over this this outer stick, under the second stick, and over this third stick. You can't go over under over because there's no tension here because this is in the back. So you want to do that, and you're gonna keep holding on tight because um, if you don't, it'll fall apart. By the way, it does take some practice a few times. Sometimes people get in on the first try. I don't know. And then you take the second stick here, and you're gonna weave it under over under the opposite of what you did with this stick so you weave over under over and if you just grab it by the end and let go voila floating now a lot of people are like well i can make these float while holding only holding on to one see look i got five popsicle sticks i hold on to one Ta-da, it floats. Oh darn, it fell. Oh gosh. So, this can be used to be like, hey, I bet I can make these, I can make five um, popsicle sticks in a structure that doesn't fall apart without glue unless you hit it like that. It falls apart really easy. If you make one, you can make, you can learn to make it pretty easy. Like so. Once you get good, you don't actually need to show it. You make it fast enough. People can't figure out how you made it unless they take a good long look. And when you want to go and destroy your evidence, you can just pull apart a corner. It all falls apart. You can do that with pretty much any corner. The best corner, I think, to pull it off on, if you know what you're doing, is to hold it and pull back, is to pull back like that, it just falls apart. But there's actually one, because if you hold it like this, and you make it, like so, this, this thing here is ready to go like a spring. If you hold it like this, if you hold it here, and you pull that off, it flies apart. It actually kind of explodes. You can also, if you, if you have the resources I have, you can actually make it crazy like I made it into a square because I know how all the properties work and it uses um 
13 or 14 uh, of these popsicle things. It's pretty cool. But um, these are actually very fun to throw against the wall. They don't always explode, but when they do, it kind of it's just kind of a wow, you know. So you try it out. Remember, three sticks, middle one in the back, weave over, under, over, and then under, over, under. And you'll come out with a Christmas tree-like design. Not always have this extra end here. You can always hold it here. And um, it should fall apart pretty fast, pretty easy. And no glue, tape, or strings attached.